Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So this is about the seat matrix for K set and Comet K. Both the exams I am giving in this video. So this is covering all of the private universities where the large number of seats are available. So first you should understand the total breakup of the seats in every college in Karnataka is like K set or KE seats are 45 percent, Comet K seats are 30 percent and the management quota seats are 25 percent so that is the breakup of any college within vtu or most of the times in the private university also it is in the same ratio so if you know the total seats which are available in the college you can find out the comet k seat so com for example a college has like 840 seats in total so comet k seats will be 30 percent of that 840 that will cover out 252 seats so officially comet k seat matrix is not out but k set or the karnataka cet seat matrix is out which i am going to show and you will know the comet k seats in each of the private universities where you want to take admission so let's first start so first university is adi chinchigiri university right you can see here this is the seat matrix for 2025 and this college i have taken example where 840 seats are there total across all the branches so in the next column you can see kea seats are mentioned as 336 so that is the kea seat but if you want to know about the comet k seats so comet k seats are basically 30 percent of 840 which i have shown in the previous sheet which is around 252 seats are through comet k so same way you will know other colleges and their seats now the next university which is there is uh, Alliance University which is based of Anekal in Bangalore and they have very large number of seats. You can see all of these are a lot of computer science, computer science and computer science specialization branches, aerospace, artificial intelligence, biotechnology, civil engineering. So you can see all the seats total intake as well as the KEA intake. And these are some more branches in uh, Alliance University and you can see the course electronics, communication, information technology, mechanical, software product development and uh, augmented reality and so on. So in, in this college, Alliance University itself, you have 1910 seats out of which 764 are through KEA. But if you want to know about the Comet K, that, that will be 30% of 1910. So Comet K seats will come around 573 seats. So you hope you understood how you get the Comet K seats from this overall seat matrix. Now let's also move further. So next college is MIT University in Bangalore and also a lot of students are inquiring about MIT University. So MIT University total seats are 1140 and KEA seats are 456. So the Comet K seats will be basically 30% of 1140 that will come around 350 seats. So total 350 seats will be through Comet K. Next move to the new university which is the CMR University. There are also around 960 seats are total available 384 through uh, KEA process and 30% of 960 will be close to 300 seats. So little less than 300 seats are through Comet K process. So you can get easily admission in CMR University as well through Comet K. Next one is the Dayanand Sagar University, right? This also has a very large number of seats. You can check around 2,640 seats are there out of which, you know, around 1,000 plus seats are through KEA and 30% of seats will be through Comet K exam. So 20, so are almost 800 to 1,000 seats will be through Comet K, 30% of 2,640. Now, next move to the another university, which is called Geetam University or Gandhi Institute of Technology and Management. They also have a very large number of seats. You can see 1100 seats out of which uh, 285 seats are through KSET exam and approximately same 250 to 300 will be through Comet K and the rest of the, the seats will be through, through their own exam called, uh, you know, Geetam admission test or GAT exam. Next university is called Garden City University. There are 900 seats are there total out of which through KSET exam is 360 and through Comet K exam will be little around 275 seats. 30% of 900 you will get through Comet K exam. 
now next move to the next university in karnataka which is gmu university which is in davangere so they also have a very large number of computer science uh, seat sites in this sheet you can see all our computer science data science cloud computing cyber uh, information security and computer science engineering ai ml and then electronics and communication and information science engineering and it continues you can see all other branches are also there including information science and total seats are 1620 lot of seats in gm university 648 are through kset exam process or kea process and 30 percent of this around you know close to 500 seats are through comet k now let's move to the next university which is jss science and technology university total 600 seats are shown and out of 600 240 seats are through kea and less than uh, you know 200 seats or 175 close to 175 seats or 180 seats will be through comet k exam out of 600 seats so here there are lesser seats in comet k now let's move to the next university which is kelly technological university which is their ms sheshagiri campus this is based out of belgam so in that ms sheshagiri campus 630 seats are there 252 through kea process and close to uh, you know 200 seats will be through the comet k pro process so every college has 30 percent through comet k now next move to the khwaja bandavaj university right 420 seats are there approximately 150 seats will be through comet k exam now next move to another new university which is there in Ballari which is called Kishkinda University. This is a new university and around 1080 seats are there right. So overall out of which 432 is through KEA process and 30% of 1080 which will come around 335 seats will be through Comet K exam. Now let's move to the another one Kelly Technology University which is the main campus of Kelly in Hubli which is also called BBB College of Engineering. So there also you can see good number of seats 1900 or approximately 2000 seats are there and 760 are, 768 seats are available in the KEA quota itself. So Comet K will be 30% of 1900 seats which will come around close to 600 seats. So 600, 600 seats around through Comet K in KLE. Now next move to another university, Ramaya University of Applied Sciences, which is based out of Bangalore. So the number of seats there is quite less, like only 1,100 seats are there, and 444 are them through KE admission process, which is the KSET exam. 30% of 1,100 seats will be close to 330 to 340 seats will be through Comet K admission process. Now let's move to the next college. PS University. PS University does not take admission through Comet K exam. Total PS University seats are 1740 and out of which KEA seats will be 696 and rest of the seats they take through J mains but they don't accept Comet K. This is another campus of PS University as you know Electronic City campus there are also 1140 seats are there through you know kea process 456 and rest will be through management quota and je mains but they don't accept comet k now let's move to the next university which is a big university which is presidency university they have very large number of branches all the branches aiml computer science engineering blockchain cyber security data science and then cst which is typical data devops and then you have all other electronics, electrical, petroleum, engineering, mechanically. So good number of seats, 3,120 seats are there, out of which 1,248 are through KSET exam. So and more than 1,000 seats are through Comet K. So good number of seats there. Next university is the Wright Technological University. Only 120 seats are there. So 30% of it will be through Comet K exam. Next move to the another university Reva University which is also a big university and every type of computer and the other branches are there so information technology aerospace even agriculture engineering EIML branch and then you have all of CSC specializations including blockchain IOT data science and every other branch is there so total seats they are showing is around 1950 
out of which through ke admission process is 780 and 30 percent of this will be around 600 plus seats will be through comet ke also exam so that is good news next one is also popular one new university rv university part of rv college of engineering they have only one seat which is ptec csc the total number of seats are 540 seats and through kea process they have 260 seats and there are no seats through comet k they don't take admission through comet k now if you move further then this is a new university which is part of saptagiri group saptagiri nps university and you can see it has very very large number of six 4260 seats in one university out of which computer science seats is 2520 so this is a private university out of which 1700 students will get admission through you know program which is like ka and 30 percent of 4200 which will come around 1300 to 1400 seats will be only through comet k exam right so the large number of seats you can easily get admission here now next move to the another university which is the shravan bavara university or appu institute of engineering and technology there 780 seats are there 300 to 12 through kea process and comet k will be close to around 250 to 300 seats through comet k now let's move to another university which is srinivas university this is based out of mangalore region lesser number of seats are there which is 510 out of which 200 seats are there through kea or the kset admission process around 150 seats will be through the comet k admission process now let's move to the next university which is the Chanakya University which is the new UST university which is based out of Bangalore. Total 600 seats are there. 240 seats are through a KEA process or the KSET. Little less than 200 seats around 180 to 190 seats will be through the Comet K process which is the 30% of the seats. Now let's move to the other university which is University of Mysore. This is not a private. This is a government university 360 seats are there 180 seats through uh KA exam there will be no seat through comet k as is the government institution and the last one or the 28th number university is the vidya shilp university again you can see total 120 seats are available and out of which 48 seats are available through the com you know ka process and 30 40 seats will be through comet k exam so that's all the list of all universities and the seats uh, total seats are around 32600 thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar important updates take care